हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू मैथमेटिक्स पाठशाला टुडे आई विल डिस्कस दिस प्रॉब्लम व्हिच कम इन सी एच आर यू जी सी नेट डिसम्बर टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी थ्री इन पार्ट बी लेट सी द प्रॉब्लम लेट एक्स बी ए नॉन एम टी फाइनाइज सेट एंड वाई कॉल टू एफ इन वर्स जीरो सच दैट एफ इज ए रियल वैल्यूड फांगशन ऑन एक्स so we have to find which one of the following statement is true so what is given x is non empty finite set so let cardinality of x equal to n so we can write x equal to x1 x2 dot dot xn where n is a finite number so what is given y equal to f inverse 0 such that f is a real valued function on x that means f is a function from x to real number r so let f inverse 0 equal to x this gives fx equal to 0 so what is y what is y y is the collection collection of what collection of all those elements all those elements which map to zero which map to zero so we have to find the collection of all those element which map to zero okay so for the simplicity let cardinality of x equal to Three. That means n equal to three. So this is the set of x. There will be x one, x two, x three, and this is the set of real number. So we have to find in such a way we can define the function in such a way x one, x two, x three goes to zero. So we have to define function in such a way it takes element. From x to zero, so we can define a function. We can define a function in such a way. X one takes from x to zero. We can define also another function function from which takes x to to zero. Which takes x to to zero. Then we can also define a function which takes x three to zero. Similarly, we can define the fun define a function two elements takes to zero. That uh, that means x one x two x one x two can goes to zero. X two x two x three can goes to zero. Also, x three x one goes to zero. Also, we can define a function in such a way all elements takes to zero. That means x one x two x three to zero. Also, we can define a function. No elements takes to zero. That that case we get phi. So we can see that what is the what is y actually? What y is the power set of x? Y is the power set of x. Power set of x. So cardinality of y. What is cardinality of y? Two to the power x. So for the for the case n equal to four, we can prove this. Similar way and also other cases. So, what is the cardinality of a y? Cardinality of y is two to the power x. Two to the power two to the power cardinality of x. Cardinality of y equal to two to the power cardinality of x. So, option two is true. Y has two to the power cardinality of cardinality of x elements and. Since cardinality of x is finite, so y has a finite set. Y is an finite set. So in the option one, what is said? Y is an in infinite. So option one is false. And in option three, what is said? There is a bijective map from x to y. There is a bijective map from x to y. For the bijective map, what we know that? Cardinality of x equal to cardinality of y. 
for this case we can see that when n equal to 3 cardinality of x equal to 3 and cardinality cardinality of y equal to 2 to the power 3 that means 8 so cardinality of x not equal to cardinality of y in this case so option 3 is false in the option 4 what is said there is a subjective fun subjective function from x to y for the for this case we know that cardinality of y less than equal to cardinality of x here cardinality of y what is 8 and cardinality of x less than cardinality of x is 3 so 8 not less than 3 so option 4 also false so option true is true so y has to do the power x elements thank you for watching